Hi everyone, it's Tammy, and today I'm going to do my plan with me. This is going to be for the first week of March. So it is March 4th through 10th. And um, the next week, so next time you see me doing a plan with me will be my collaboration with Tracy. And this is also Tracy's birthday week because her birthday is the 6th. Mine is the 11th and hers is the 6th, so it's fun. So I have some really cute stickers or kits to use and um, figure out which one I want to use for her birthday. I just now thought of that and I'm like, oh gosh, I hope I got some. Oh, I think I might use this one. Okay, so let's see. My son has something going on on the 8th of March and I am going to use this one for that because I think this is cool. It, um, it's kind of a sassy cat and it says hang in there and it was just really cute. The kit is called Hang In There by Lisa Lorraine. So I'm gonna to try to remember to use this one on the 8th. And I think I'm gonna use this one on the 6th for Tracy's birthday, because look how cute this is. Oh my goodness, this is perfect. So I'll use this one on, oh, there's even more. I'll use this one on the 6th. This one on the 8th, six, seven, eight. And I don't usually pick out which day I'm gonna use them on, or if I do, I forget about it, and then I'm just, oh, which oh, I, I was gonna do that, but. I don't usually plan it. I just open the page and go for it. But this one is a kit from Jump To It. And I remember I used to love that she included this unicorn page of just functionals, which is adorable. And I'm going to have to use that throughout. Here's some extra glitter tabs. And then look at how cute these guys are. It's called Bundles of Love. Now, if you guys don't know me or are new to my channel, thank you for joining. I'm glad you're here. Aw, pets are bundles of love wrapped in fur. I am using my stash. So I have had some of these stickers for years, and I do not know if they're still available. I do not know if the shop is even still open or anything, but they're part of my stash, and I know that I need to use some of this stuff. So that's what I'm working on. And I haven't bought a bunch of anything new. If anything, I can't even think of anything that I've purchased this year other than I know I have a subscription, a monthly subscription, but whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm enjoying what I'm doing with these. And I use a kit a day, like a different kit each day, but I will reuse whatever I don't use. So like I'll put it back in my stash so I can use it again because I know that some of these are made for an entire week and I just don't plan that way. I plan, a, I have a two page spread per day and I have a uh, ring bound extra wide, or extra, not extra wide, just wide personal planner and I love it. And you know, you'll see that in a minute, but these are from Imagine That by Lori, who makes really cute stickers. Her taste of the critters and everything is very similar to mine, so I really like that. Ooh, this would be a cute one for birthday, too. I don't have, I need to get a washi to match, but this is from Shine Sticker Studio. This is really cute. Now I'm wondering which one I should use for her birthday. The Tiffany one or the other one? Oh, I don't know. I'm going to have to figure that out. This one is, it looks like Busy Planning, and it's B-I-Z-Z-I-E. And this kit is called Staying In. And, oh, it's cute. has a bunch of boxes. And I will use... Like if if I use Thursday on this I and I want to reuse Tuesday on another, I will. I don't have any problem like switching kits or any of that, like moving them around. This is really cute too. I might do that for the weekend. Although I don't know, that's not maybe not a good idea. And I'm not gonna pick right yet. But this one is a Shine Sticker Studio. I think I got this at Michael's and it's a weekly sticker kit and I haven't even looked at them for a long time, but when I breezed through it to look at it to see what kits I wanted to use, I thought of these because I have several of these and I haven't used them or haven't used much of them, but these are really cute. There's, and I don't, it says for a weekly spread, but I think they give you far more than just a week anyway. Oh, there's one gone. Uh, 
I don't know if I did that or if it was just, there's a weekend sticker. So I don't know if, if people actually use that. I mean, this would fill up, this would be a no white space week for sure, even in like the Erin Condren or the plum paper or whatever, but it's really cute. I love it. So I'm going to use this one as well. So I'm going to fast forward you guys and get my planner out and I'll, you guys can see me plan as I play some music. Who knows what kind of music you're going to get. And then at the end, I will do a flip through with you and show you each page. So here we go.
you up just a little bit so you could see maybe the whole spread I didn't realize you were, weren't exactly seeing that but here is oh Tuesday <laughs> here is Monday Monday the 4th of March wow I used the pets are bundles of love wrapped in fur and I didn't have enough room so I kind of just made it fit but I think it turned out cute and I did remember to put doodle space on each day I believe so I think that spread turned out really cute and then here's the donut spread from that kit I think it's best to write in sharpie on this and I had written that I was working from home and then I had to change it to the office I actually have a big day at the office that day we have a guest coming in reviewing some contracts and yeah it's just gonna be a big day but it'll be a good one I think and then I thought that maybe I could make a list of some things that I do. Maybe I'll do my cards that day and I can write them out or at least the cards that I need to send. I don't know. Um, but there's my doodle space. And this is somebody's birthday. Happy birthday, Tracy. Happy birthday. And I like the balloons, even though it didn't quite match, but I think it turned out cute. And I wasn't sure when I was doing this washi, I think these are the same color. <laughs> It was a real struggle. So, and I didn't want to go to the dark, dark because that didn't really go. And I didn't have exactly the greenish, bluish. And I might, I should have maybe done a better job, but I think it turned out cute. I like how this one too, I don't know if you can see, but it goes from blue to silver to blue. And I think it's because the sunlight has hit it where I had it stored because it was out. I don't know if you can see that at all. Maybe I'll bring it up a little bit in I think you can tell but it's kind of funny and I was gonna change it and then I thought no I kind of like it I think it looks kind of pretty so I left it even though it might not look the cutest oh and I just noticed oh gosh it's just sticking over just a hair I shouldn't even worry about it but you know I will there you go. And I think that turned out really cute so I'm excited for her birthday it's her birthday I think I can safely say, no, I'll just wait. So very cute. And then Thursday, I'm working from home and I love this kit. I love the cookies and milk and cookies, milk and cookies. I don't know if you guys have seen Bernie Mac does Eric Dead Hall, oh, bless his heart and his family. Mm. Um, he did a, a, comedy strip I don't know what you call it but he did an act or a, he, I don't know he did a skit with uh, about uh, his niece I think wanting milk and cookies in the middle of the night and her looking at him like he was short it was hilarious so if you guys haven't seen that look that up on YouTube 
Bernie Mac milk and cookies and it's hilarious. I'm sure it's there. I haven't seen it there myself, but I'm sure it's there. Everything is available on YouTube, it seems. So I thought that turned out really cute. And then Friday is the day that Alex has something going on. So I put Believe here, Caution Sassy Cat. I'm working from home that day. It says hang in there. And then I thought maybe if I learn more about it, I can put some information on the back of this. And if not, I can still use it for something or I can just make it be a cutie in here. A tip in, I think is what they call it. Tracy, you'll correct me if I'm wrong. And then I also put Never Alone and I thought that was cute because there's two cats in this little bag. So we are never alone. God is always with us. And I want my son to feel that and know that on this day because I'm not going to be with him. And he's a grown man. It's fine. He's 24. Uh, which is still crazy for me to say. I can't believe he's that old. He, it's not like he needs me there, but you know, you when there are important things going on in people's lives that you love, you like to support them, but I'm sure he knows that I support him. So it's all good. So there's Friday the 8th. And then Saturday the 9th, this was the other kit that I was maybe going to use for Tracy's birthday, but I did I sent her a picture and asked her which she'd prefer, and she said breakfast at Tiffany's. So I don't blame her at all because we love Audrey. And so that was her birthday spread. And this one just turned out to be a Saturday spread. And I think it's a lovely. I love it, love it, love it. I love this gal. So, so cute. And you know what? This It's probably a good idea because I tend to really like these dolls. I call them dolls or gals or whatever. And Tracy does not. So I think it probably worked out the way it should have. Because if I would have chosen this for her, she probably she would have liked the other one better, obviously. So very cute. And then Sunday, I did kind of a lazy Sunday. It says dream big and has a little dog sleeping. I think we're going to have Hazel. No, I don't think we're going to have Hazel. This is my birthday weekend, isn't it? No, I don't think we're going to have Hazel. So I don't know what we're going to do, but um, still cute. When I was doing it, I was thinking, oh, we're have Hazel. So it's probably not going to be a lazy day because when she's around, it's certainly not, but it's a fun day. But, um, even lazy days are fun days. So I don't know what we're going to do, but it's a cute spread. So that's what I went for. So that is my last day of the week. I'll go through it. I, okay, I'm going to go through it one more time with you guys, just so we can see them all. Here's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. All right. Well, that's that. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you have a wonderful week and I hope the music wasn't too much. I don't really get to listen to it because you'd have to listen to all of it. And frankly, I don't have that kind of time. So I just start it, make sure I kind of like it and then put it in there. But I understand that sometimes it's way different, but it's free music and it's available on my YouTube studio. So that's how I do it. If any of you have a better way or know of an, another easy way to do free music, because I don't want to get copyright charged, I would definitely um, love to hear it. So thanks so much for watching and have a beautiful, beautiful day. Beautiful week. Bye.